Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. If you're facing network internet issues on your computer again and again, especially on Windows 11, then this tutorial is for you because after watching this quick tutorial, you will be able to fix this and any kind of connection issues in the Windows 11 computer in a quick minute. So the very first thing which you can do whenever your connectivity or internet is not uh, working, just do a right click in the start icon, go to run and type ncpa.cpl. So basically we are going to disable the adapter and enable the adapter. This fixes 90% of the problem. So once you open that, just see your Wi-Fi or the Ethernet which you are using. Do a right click, click on disable wait for a few seconds and once it is disabled do a right click and enable for most of us this will fix the internet issue and you will have your wi-fi connection back if it doesn't what you can do is you can clear the dns you can flush the dns from your computer again a quick tip quick command click on search icon type cmd and then run as administrator and then it will ask you to say yes and when you see administrator command prompt type ip config space space forward slash flush dns and hit enter so this will also again fix if any website issue is happening, you're, enable, you're unable to open a specific thing, then this flushing the DNS should work for you. And the third and last command is if you have tried restart and everything, and if it still doesn't work, you can do the network reset. And to do that, you just need to do a right click in the start icon, go to settings, and then go to network and internet and go to advanced network settings and at the bottom you will find network reset reset all network adapters to factory settings now please make sure you should know your password and everything to connect to the internet again for the wi-fi so you just need to click on that and you click on reset now and for most of us this again bring back the wi-fi icon for you and fix the problem for you so these are the three most effective troubleshooting steps which you can follow every time whenever you face the problem if you find this tutorial helpful please please hit the like and subscribe i really need your support i'll see you in the next tutorial have a wonderful day